Hello and welcome. Today I have a work in progress ship. It's the tier 8 British destroyer, the Cossack. I know that the ship has been um, in a test before, but she apparently wasn't good enough to release. Um, hopefully this one will go better, uh, because I didn't like the earlier version of her, but I do like actually, but I do like this one. However, there is one thing you need to keep in mind, and that is this is not exactly the version that the game will get, at least according to the latest developer blog posts. You see, this ship has 5.1 kilometer concealment as a tier 8 destroyer, which is quite, you know, insane. Um, however, I read that they were nerfing it by about 400 meters. However, they are taking care of the worst thing about the Cossack, the thing that we really disliked even in the initial version, you know, the really bad firing arcs apparently they are quite significantly buffing them which in my opinion is a great idea and hopefully that will make the ship very fun to play anyways she still has the one torpedo launcher but you can st still s launch single launch torpedoes um which is nice i suppose i do wonder if she keeps her uh, speed boost because the same developer blog post said that the British destroyers are not going to have their speed boost. Uh, so maybe the Cossack won't have it either. However, she has a Hydro, which is really short range. However, it's a very long duration. I believe this one is without the uh, Hydro upgrade, the special one. Although I'm not quite 100% certain on it. So the Hydro does last a long time. However, the range is short, so... People joke that it's mostly about avoiding torpedoes, just like this. And since I was reversing, I can't exactly accelerate forwards. So we're going to uh, try to maneuver out of the way of these. And I think that went quite well. Okay, so there's a destroyer ahead of me. I guess I need to be wary of that. However, because of my insanely good concealment at 5.1 kilometers which in my opinion is overpowered as hell i don't think i really need to care about another destroyer because i will spot her far before she spots me and there's a monarch uh, since i can launch single launch torpedoes i don't expect her to sail in a completely straight line so i will try to you know launch my torpedoes at slightly different positions so that um so that, you know, she doesn't actually... Uh... What am I saying? I'm launching my torpedoes, one, two torpedoes first, then I wait for a while until her damage control party runs off, and then I launch the second set, expecting the monarch to do some kind of turn or slow down because, you know, you saw the torpedoes, you got hit by them, just as she did. You know, I expect her to change something about her course or maneuvering, so that she wouldn't get hit by other ones, except it seems she didn't care. And unfortunately, I seem to have outplayed myself. Which is sad. I should have just launched all four in the line, and that would have been the best case scenario there. Oh well. I'm going back into the decap, because obviously the uh, cap zone is being under attack. And because of my excellent concealment range... I got to spot the DD way before she spot me. Um, I do smoke, but I am kind of scared. Well, I was kind of scared that I was going to get um, hit by the Z-23 torpedoes. However, as we can see, the torpedoes are already pa passing by me. So this means she cannot have torpedoes. So I do not have to worry about that. So I can simply just sit here in this uh, smoke screen and just shell away against that Colorado. I want to launch some torpedoes, although I don't have much hope of hitting these, but maybe I'll get lucky. Since there's a second destroyer somewhere over there too, I believe. There is a chance, and there's a New Orleans incoming, and wait. New Orleans doesn't have radar anymore, right? I think she doesn't, so this should be safe. So, we'll get some... Quite easy damage on her. Okay, another set of torpedoes and they passed by. Although if those had been on point, I would have been sunk here. Oh! Apparently my torpedoes in the Colorado were quite on point. Or rather, let's be fair, I can't really say that that was me being really really good at predicting. 
That was more like the Colorado going, a destroyer shooting me? Why would she ever torpedo me? Let's just sail in a straight line. What could possibly go wrong? And well, there's what could go wrong. Oh, of course, when I swapped AP, as she is showing, yeah, torpedoes. No, 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 no. Let's slow down. Let's even use speed boost to slow down faster and start reverse. Come on, come on. That was quite close. But, you know, it was all calculated, okay? Don't worry about it. It was... Everything went according to plan, okay? No, wait, there's a meme. No, not a meme. From this certain weeb show that I used to watch. That had something to do with plans. Okay, this is not nice. I'm being shelled by a DD. A Z23, in fact. Wait, no. Actually, I think I'm being shelled by something else. Okay, somebody please finish off that New Orleans, please. I don't want her to sail away at 200 HP and try to... Okay, good. Thank you very much, Leon. And now let's shell the Z23. Wait, there's two of them. This is unfair. This is a one versus two. In fact, they even have a York over there. Come on. That's really unfair. I'm not bringing a cruiser into this fight. Look look at the minimap. There isn't a single cruiser on my team helping me. Luckily, Smokescreen helps me out. Smokescreen is a very nice person. I guess that Z23 is gonna hide behind the island, so let's shoot the other one. Oh, never mind. The Z23 has hydro. Yeah, I forgot about that one. Luckily, though, I should be fairly safe from the opposing team's torpedoes because I have my own Hydro. However, there is no point in sitting here if, um, you know, she's gonna Hydro me and I'm spotted and I have more HP than she does, so I could just go and fight her and sink her, hopefully. She does get an advantage here, though, because she can reverse behind the island and she sees me as I approach. So she gets a few shots off and oh god, that, that fire, please no. Okay, come on. Appear already. Okay, there she is. Oh god, she, it's two fires. No, 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 no. This is... This was some bad news. Come on. Oh god, another fire. Okay, this is dangerous. Come on, we need to sink her. Quickly now. Quickly, quickly. Come on. Please sink Z23. Excellent. Hey, 600 HP and I'm on fire. Um, um, please, 200, 180, 134, 88, 43, and 4. Okay, well, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry, did I say anything? I mean, this was completely planned and calculated. I knew I was going to have 3 HP too much anyway. I mean... There was no question about it that I would survive. Come on, who do you think I am? Okay, time to torpedo that Edinburgh now. But because it's an Edinburgh, I expect her to have Hydro or something along those lines and she will dodge and be able to uh, start fighting me. So in that case, I'm going to just slow down and uh, smoke up and start shelling her. Because, you know, an Edinburgh has a really easy time dodging torpedoes. Look, she's already turning right now. I'm already slowing down to get my shots off. And she dies to a torpedo. Wow, this smoke was really useful. Super useful smoke right here. So I guess I'm gonna go and try to cap B. And oh, do, uh, no, no, no Z23. No, 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 no. Please, no. No, 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 no. Dodge, 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 dodge. Okay, we dodge those. Dodge these too. <sighs> Ooh, this was really, really, really close. But we survived, okay? Through uh, superior skill. And uh, now I can just abuse the 5.1 kilometer concealment range and there's nothing that Z23 can do about it. I plan to take a shot when uh, she gets lower and there 
There it is. Come on, all turrets, turn and fire. Or not. Okay, let's fire and somebody else stole my kill. However, we still won the game, so it's all fine. Like I mentioned though, the 5.1 kilometer concealment, which is quite overpowered, is being nerfed to 5.5 and I expect that to definitely change. Hopefully the uh, other changes stick as well. Look, I spotted seven ships, captured the base, sank three ships, got 2227 base XP, did a nice 93k damage in a tier 8 destroyer. Can't really complain about anything in this game considering I didn't even get sunk. So, this was a great game. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this work in progress ship. So, remember, anything about the ship might still change. And um, I would like to thank the patrons on Patreon. Thank you very much for being very patient with me. Uh, thank you for the continued support, Stoic Frog Gaming. And I hope I'll see you guys next time.